In 2006, I broke my leg uh, two days before the NCAA tournament. Um, I was a junior in college at Penn State. I got surgery two days later. So I would like crutch to go into a different room only like 10 feet away and I was breathing so hard. Something was wrong. And I get to the hospital and they put me through, you know, and said, okay, why are you here, blah, 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 put me through all the tests and said, okay, we need you to come back immediately. And I get back to the hospital bed and I was laying there just totally in shock. I had no idea um, if I would live. With all the tests we need to put you on blood thinners, you are having a pulmonary embolism and you have multiple blood clots in your legs and your lungs and you're experiencing many heart attacks. And they said if you would have fallen asleep that night, then you probably most likely wouldn't have woken up. And hearing that, it just put a lot in perspective for me. I was 21 years old and I wasn't sure at the time if I would live and you know, follow through with my dreams of playing at this level or you know, continue playing soccer at all. Lying in that bed you know, for the week and seeing my parents there and my friends coming in from school and my, my best friends you know, from my team and, and just at Penn State, that was in itself an uplifting experience because I knew how many people cared about me. My brother at that time was in um, a bit of a different place. He was struggling with addiction, and you know, during that period, he actually didn't realize that that was happening. It was actually right after that that he, you know, made the decision to become sober. He's like my mentor. He's a huge inspiration for me. You know, he builds me up and makes sure that I realize how great of a, an experience this is and how great that these moments are. He keeps me grounded in that and, you know, makes me realize that not everyone gets this opportunity, so I need to take it and I need to, you know, make sure I give it my all.